now we talk a little about the barometer and the atmospheric pressure the atmospheric pressure its measurement is so important to us it plays an important role in our daily life so isiliye even uh, whether it is met office or even in general talk we discuss uh, the atmospheric pressure the pressure at sea level above sea level and so on और आपको पता ही होगा जनरल नॉलेज से कि हम कहते हैं कि जिस वक्त हाई प्रेशर है तो इट्स ऑल सनी धूप निकली हुई होती है और लो प्रेशर हो तो इट इनवाइट्स रेन तो अगर बारिशें होनी हो लो क्लाउड में लो प्रेशर में क्लाउड्स इकट्ठे हो जाते हैं और देन देर इज़ ए रेनफॉल तो इसकी मेजरमेंट्स इसकी इम्पोर्टेंट इट हैज़ ए वैल्यू the planes are flying and so many other uses there it has application so it important to us that we should know the the change the atmospheric change that is taking place as far as pressure is concerned atmospheric pressure is measured by a device that is called barometer thus the atmospheric pressure is often referred to as barometric pressure to baaz auqat hum एटमोसफेरिक प्रेशर को बैरोमेट्रिक प्रेशर भी कहते हैं क्योंकि एटमोसफेरिक प्रेशर बैरोमीटर से डिवाइस कॉल्ड बैरोमीटर जिस तरह से ब्लड प्रेशर वगैरह जो ट्यूब की फॉर्म में होते हैं वो मैनोमीटर से मेजर किए जाते हैं तो इसी तरह यहाँ पर वी अप्लाई बैरोमीटर एंड बैरोमेट्रिक प्रेशर इज ऑल्सो द सेम थिंग एज एटमोसफेरिक प्रेशर बैरोमीटर क्या है एक सिंपल ट्यूब है as you can see in the picture the pressure at point b is equal to the atmospheric pressure and the pressure at c can be taken to be zero since there is no mercury vapor above the point c and the pressure is uh, very low relative to atmospheric pressure and can be neglected uh, to an excellent approximation agar hum is picture ko dobara dekhe तो सी सरफेस पे एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर शो हो रहा है उसे ऊपर एयर है सो दैट इज व्हाट इज बीन रेफर टू और प्रेशर बी है क्योंकि इफ वी डिप द ट्यूब द इन्वर्टेड ट्यूब इनटू ए सर्टेन कंटेनर कंटेनिंग अ लिक्विड इन दिस केस ए मरकरी और आमतौर से मरकरी इज ए गुड स्टैंडर्ड फॉर मेजरिंग प्रेशर so writing a force balance in the vertical direction it will give us atmospheric pressure to be rho g f rho g h ye hum pehle discuss kar chuke hain aur vertical direction mein unless there is a significant change in the density of the liquid under consideration iski value hamesha calculate ki jati hai rho g h se and this formula although it's very simple but it's very important it's being used it's used in hydraulics irrigation fluids etc etc lot many applications rho is the density of mercury in this very case g is the gravitational forces as always and h is the height of the mercury column above the uh, free above the surface note that the length and the cross sectional area of the tube have no effect on the height of the fluid column of a barometer to so, ye formula se bhi ya zahir hai p is equal to rho g h to isme height to show ho rahi hai vertical height to vary karegi if it varies lekin as far as the diameter or the cross sectional area of the tube is concerned na wo usme shamil hai और ना उसको कंसिडर किया जा रहा है सो इट मीन्स दैट इट इज नॉट इम्पॉर्टेंट नॉट बींग कंसिडर्ड एंड इट डज नॉट प्ले एनी रोल इन कैलकुलेटिंग दी प्रेशर इन द वर्टिकल डायरेक्शन ए फ्रीक्वेंटली यूज प्रेशर यूनिट इज ए स्टैंडर्ड एटमोसफेयर विच इज डिफाइंड एज द प्रेशर प्रोड्यूस्ड बाई ए कॉलम ऑफ मर्क्री that is 760 mm 
in height at 0 degrees centigrade. Uh, this is, you can see how important it is. The temperature 0 degrees centigrade because that is the standard temperature that the scientists have agreed to consider. And we know that with temperature, the density changes. It changes not much for the liquids, but for the gases. Or because if we consider atmospheric pressure, consider kar rahe hai, at very large heights, uh, vertical heights, the density may significantly change. And therefore, these values and standardization. So the standard atmospheric pressure is considered to be 760 millimeter in height at 0 degree centigrade and rho mercury ki density is taken to be 13.595 kilogram per meter cube under standard gravitational acceleration and where the value of g is equal to 9.807 uh, meter per second square. 